Hey guys, my name is Casey and welcome to my channel. I'll be posting as much as possible about backpacking, hiking, running, and biking. Please subscribe and I hope you like the video. I think that looks done. It looks pretty good. Wow. Yeah. Right there. <laughs> this past weekend, I went to one of my favorite areas for hiking and craft beer, Vermont. Specifically, I planned an overnight loop around Stratton Mountain and Stratton Pond in the Southern Green Mountain National Forest. I was lucky enough to have a few friends join me on this hike. Aaron? Lauren, Bone up. Brendan, <laughs> and an unpaid intern. We arrived early to the trailhead after car camping nearby the night before. Our hike would mostly be following Vermont's Long Trail, which is a 272 mile long distance trail running the entire length of the state. It's also the oldest long distance trail in the United States. Although the climb up Stratton Mountain was only moderate, we found ourselves stopping frequently to enjoy the wildflowers. I'm a little rusty on my botany. If anyone knows the names of these flowers, please comment down below. After a couple hours of hiking, we've finally reached the summit.
decided to hang at the summit and enjoy some local craft beer that we packed in. You'll soon find out that this is my luxury item. We felt like we could stay there all day, but decided to descend to the pond. I saw people coming that way too. We were surprised to still find snow in late May. With the sun quickly setting, we decided to backtrack, set up camp, and return for the sunset, dinner, and ponderitas. For those of you wondering how to make my famous ponderita, it's a shot of tequila. <laughs> this is not filtered water. Splash of pond. Okay. I gotta do it the natural way. And season to taste with your favorite lemonade mix. We met some awesome hikers from Northern Vermont who were nice enough to share their hiker TV for the night. One of the guys was crazy enough to backpack in an 11 pound Dutch oven to bake cherry cobbler for his friends. Luckily, Brendan was able to trade some of his homemade bread for some cherry cobbler. It was well worth it. I think that much is done. It looks pretty good. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Yeah. 
Give it like about four more minutes and we'll eat it. Okay. Four minutes. Can we get a round of applause, please? Ooh, yeah. I'm impressed. I'm very impressed. Everybody's so good. In the morning, we packed up and hiked our remaining miles back to the trailhead. This was an amazing loop that I would highly recommend. I'm glad I was able to share it with friends and meet some new along the way. We also found out that Aaron is really good at handstands. It was a hike I won't forget and I can't wait to return. Thanks so much for watching. If you got anything out of this video, please hit the like button or comment down below. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell. I'll be linking my Instagram down below as well. See you guys on the trail!